More formal complaints of bullying and harassment are being made against the Lethbridge Police Service, but this time against Interim Chief Scott Woods. As Jeanette Rocher explains, this comes following a trail of complaints that were made against former Chief Rob Davis. Jeanette, what can you tell us about this? Yeah, Hal. Well, according to a public document in the Canadian Legal Information Institute, or CANLI, several complaints were filed between May and August of last year against LPS Interim Police Chief Scott Woods while he was still the Deputy Chief. These complaints were under review by the Alberta Law Enforcement Review Board up until last month. The legal document, which is available on the Canley website, alleges that both Woods and the former chief, Rob Davis, bullied and harassed the complainant, Sergeant Jay Moulton. In the document, Moulton alleges tyrannical and bullying behavior over the course of nearly a year. Moulton states that the behavior included isolating and demeaning him and sustained attacks on his career. He stated the behavior appeared to be retaliatory after he'd confronted Woods about a serious issue. The situation got even more grainy when the former chief, Rob Davis, left LPS, leaving Deputy Scott Woods to act as interim chief in his place. Because of his resignation, the commission dropped the case against Davis. They also dismissed the case against Woods, because he was now the interim chief and complaints were filed while he was deputy chief. Moulton requested a review with the Alberta Law Enforcement Review Board regarding his complaints against Woods. The board informed the commission that an external investigation should be conducted since Woods is now the interim chief and can't investigate himself. In an April 9th decision by the board, they've declared that jurisdiction is now to be put back in the hands of the police commission and that complaints about the conduct of a chief should be addressed regardless of whether or not he became chief before or after the complaint was filed. And the investigation into the matter has been reopened. We did reach out to LPS for comment, but we're told that interim police chief Scott Woods was unavailable today for comment. For Bridge City News, I'm Jeanette Roche.